This video describes the setup change automation now available in Esprit Edge. Esprit Edge allows programming of multiple operations with different setups in the same document, making programming easier and faster. Esprit Edge is also more automated. Any changes in the programming automatically propagates to the successive setups, triggering optimization of the program for the new conditions. The setup change automation simplifies the overall programming workflow and provides essential features to support fixture change, part flip on mill and lathe, palette changes, and more complex scenarios. In this video, we will demonstrate four scenarios of setup change. A change of clamping on a vertical mill machine, a part flip on a lathe, a tailstock temporarily mounted in a subspindle, and a part flip with the two operations mounted side by side. In the first example, we want to machine this Y bracket on a Fanuc RoboDrill 3-axis mill machine. Machining is only possible on one side at a time, so the process would require a clamping change to achieve the complete machining. Indeed, in the first setup, the workpiece is on a supporting plate and both are clamped together with three top clamps. The first machining sequence is about facing, drilling, and boring the three holes so we can then bolt the workpiece down to the plate in a second setup. To add a second setup, click on Add Setup. Note that Esprit Edge automatically duplicates the previous setup so we only make the necessary changes. Mount the workpiece 1-2 onto the fixture which is the resulted stock from the first operation. The workpiece gets bolted with three screws. We make a copy to add a fourth clamp and move the clamps to the corner of the supporting plate. This setup gives us access to outside of the workpiece to complete the machining. Setup 2 is created in the program manager and we can continue the programming with a second sequence. We have a single program with a stop code to perform the reclamping and the full machining of the workpiece. In this second example, we are programming a fluid control component that we cut on a DMG Mori NLX 2500Y single spindle machine. We cut the first side and we now need to flip the workpiece to continue machining the second side. Moving on the machine setup, we add a new setup and mount the sequence 2 of workpiece 1. Use the transformation option to properly position the workpiece in the chuck. After validation, setup 2 is created. In this third example, note that it is possible to use a tail stock and a spindle, remove it, and then use the spindle for the rest of the program. Tail stock as well as steady rest and rotary tables can also be mounted or unmounted in a setup. Finally, in this last example, we mounted the raw stock on the left vise and the resulting stock from the first operation on the right vise. The first operation is machined in setup 1. For setup 2, we add workpieces 1 and 2, so the first side and second side are machined side by side. By doing so, a spree edge allows you to save time on programming and on the machining process. With setup changes, you can manage multiple operations in a single document, simplifying data management. The setup change automation improves the programming workflow with easier and faster programming. If a change occurs in the process, the change is automatically propagated to the successive setups and the program updates automatically. The program is always up to date, preventing programming errors. Thank you for watching this Esprit Edge product video. For more information on this and other Esprit Edge features, refer to the release bulletin and product help.